Hmm. Astronaut at the bottom of the sea. I lived for two weeks in the bottom of the sea. Oh, Jesus. What the fuck? You could do that? Two weeks? (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. How deep? It was exactly 20,000 millimeters under the sea. It was about 60 feet. The cool thing. The cool thing? (laughs) What the fuck is cool about? I mean, don't get me wrong. I would go scuba diving. I would want to see what was down there. But after the first day, I'm cool. I seen it all. I'm good. I don't need to be down there. But that's me. His interest is obviously better than mine's. And I used to, I used to, to me, let's talk about the sea real quick. We do not know what the fuck is down there. Everybody is up at space. It's been this, okay. It's been this, uh, this conversation about this, about space being connected to the ocean. I don't know how true it is. I seen some shit about it. I just read about it. It's, it could be conspiracy. Who knows? But we don't know enough about space and we damn sure don't know enough about the ocean for me to even make that. You know what I'm saying? But the space is definitely it's supposedly endless and so is the sea. Because we have not been able to go past a certain amount of amount of depth. So we don't know what's down there, which is very interesting. And I don't know why I don't know how we haven't started there first, but we went to space. That's very interesting to me. How are we gonna go outer outside of our planet to find out what's up there when we don't even know what's on our planet? Just saying. Thing was, we stayed there for weeks. If you're normally scuba diving and yeah, you go down 60 good. feet, you have 60 minutes, and then you got to come back up, or you get too much nitrogen in your blood, and you're gonna you're gonna get bent. What the fuck? If you stay down there longer than that, what the fuck do you mean you're gonna get bent? Like you gonna die? Which would make sense, but like, what the fuck? Get That's bent. Pretty- it's not a problem if you just stay. The problem is then if you stay, you build up all that nitrogen in your blood. Now you can't go back up. Hmm. You can turn into a fish? What the fuck you mean you can't go back up? So how do you eventually get out? It's a freaky thing. It takes about a day. So we're living in this habitat, and it was kind of like a submarine on the bottom of the ocean. So we're just like stuck on the floor. And the only thing that was keeping the ocean out was the air pressure inside. Kind of like taking a cup and flipping it over, putting it in the bathtub and trapping the air. So what you do is you close up that hole, and you convert the habitat into a pressure chamber. And what you do is you very, very slowly bring the pressure back to sea level. So you decrease the pressure as if you're slowly, slowly going up in the water column. As you do it gradually, the, the nitrogen slowly comes out of your blood and you can feel it, it kind of tingles i live for two that's some very interesting shit let's check these comments out because i'm dumb confused yeah that was weird to me it being tingly the the nice shit coming out of your blood yeah what the fuck she looked up how many she thought you mean <laughs> Bro, two weeks in under in the ocean, my nigga, sixty feet down. That's a lot. I don't care what he's talking about. This conversation. Fun fact: Uh, see, I believe it. Uh, the bottom of the sea is a young scissor when you open it. I don't know. Okay, whatever. Two weeks is crazy. Like, what were they? Like, what were they trying to do down there? When you say can't come back up, do you mean like if you come back, you'll die, or you're officially a fish person now? Like, what the fuck? I'm mad confused. Y'all let me know. Would y'all do this shit? I wouldn't do it. After a day of being, first of all, an hour of being in the water, it'd be cool. It'd be a nice experience. But after that, I don't, I feel like unless we are uncharted territories, like we've never been this far down, unless we never did this before, nobody's ever experienced this before. It makes no sense for me to be down there for two weeks. What are we looking for? That's the part I want to know. What are we looking for down here for two weeks? Are we just trying to experience what it'd be like if we lived in the water? Or are we looking for something or some things that he didn't discuss? Because otherwise, this doesn't make sense to me. I'm all about the adventure, but this shit doesn't make sense to me. That I ask. Y'all let me know down in the comments below how y'all feel about this.